Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're diving into a question that many of us can relate to. Why am I always hungry? If you're constantly feeling those hunger pangs no matter how much you eat, stick around. The first big reason you might always feel hungry is not eating enough protein. Protein is super important because it helps you feel full and satisfied. If your meals are mostly carbs and fats, you might be missing out on that satiating power of protein. Make sure you're including sources like chicken, fish, beans, or tofu in your diet. Next up, let's talk about fiber. Fiber is like your digestive system's best friend. It slows down the digestion process, helping you feel full longer. Foods rich in fiber, like fruits, veggies, whole grains, and legumes, should be a staple in your meals. If you're eating a lot of processed foods, you might not be getting enough fiber, which can leave you feeling hungry soon after eating. If you're feeling hungry, it might actually be a sign of dehydration. Our bodies can sometimes confuse thirst with hunger. Try drinking a glass of water the next time you feel hungry and see if that helps. Lack of sleep can seriously mess with your hunger hormones, ghrelin and leptin. When you're sleep deprived, ghrelin levels go up and leptin levels go down, making you feel hungrier than usual. Aim for seven, nine hours of quality sleep each night to keep your hunger in check. When you're stressed, your body releases cortisol, a hormone that can increase your appetite. Finding healthy ways to manage stress, like exercise, meditation, or talking to a friend, can help keep those stress-induced cravings at bay. Regular physical activity can increase your appetite because your body needs more fuel to sustain itself. It's important to refuel with nutritious foods that will keep you satisfied, not just empty calories. Underlying medical conditions like hyperthyroidism, diabetes, or certain medications can increase your appetite. If you're constantly hungry despite eating well, it might be a good idea to check in with your doctor.